I didn't think I'd say this, but I'm going to say it, and I hate to say it, but if I win, I am going to instruct my Attorney General to get a special prosecutor to look into your situation, because there has never been so many lies, so much deception, there has never been anything like it, and we're going to have a special prosecutor. When I speak, I go out and speak, the people of this country are furious. In my opinion, the people that have been long-term workers at the FBI are furious. There has never been anything like this where emails and you get a subpoena, you get a subpoena, and after getting the subpoena, you delete 33 thousand emails and then you acid wash them or bleach them as you would say a very expensive process so we're going to get a special prosecutor and we're going to look into it because you know what people have been their lives have been destroyed for doing one fifth of what you've done and it's a disgrace and honestly you ought to be ashamed of Secretary yourself Clinton, no, i want to follow let, up let, on that yeah, i'm going to let, let you talk about it because everything he just said is absolutely false but i'm not oh, surprised really? in the first debate and we in the really, first the debate, audience needs to I calm told down people here. that it would be impossible to be fact-checking Donald all the time. I'd never get to talk about anything I want to do and how we're going to really uh, make lives better for people. So, once again, go to HillaryClinton.com. We have literally Trump. You can fact-check him, fact -check, fact -check him in real time. Last time at the first debate, we had millions of people uh, fact-checking, so I expect we'll have millions more fact-checking uh, because, you know, it is, uh, it's just awfully good that someone with the temperament of Donald Trump is not in charge of the law in our country. Yeah, because you'd be in jail. Secretary Clinton. <laughs> that was a mistake, and I take responsibility for using a personal email account. Uh, obviously, if I were to do it over again, I would not. I'm not making any excuses. Uh, it was a mistake, and I am very uh, sorry about that. But I think it's also important uh, to point out where there are some misleading accusations from critics and others. Uh, after a year-long investigation, there is no evidence that anyone hacked the server I was using. And there is no evidence that anyone uh, can point to at all, anyone who says otherwise has no basis, that any classified material ended up in the wrong hands. But for you to say that there was nothing wrong with you deleting 39,000 emails, again, you should be ashamed of yourself. What you did, and this is after getting a subpoena, it's just not true, and so please you, oh, go you didn't to, delete them? You Allow didn't her to delete respond, please. personal emails, not oh, official. 33,000? Yeah, not, right. well, we turned over 35,000, so oh, yeah. it was. What about the other 15,000? Uh, please allow her to respond. She didn't talk while you talked. Yes, that's true, I didn't. Because and you I didn't in the say. first debate, and uh, I'm gonna try not to in this debate, because uh, I'd like to get to the questions that the people have brought here tonight uh, to talk to us about. And get off this question. Okay, Donald, I know you're into big diversion tonight. Anything to avoid talking about your campaign and the way it's exploding and the way Republicans are leaving you. But well, let's, let's, let's at least focus on some response. of the issues that people care about tonight. Let's get to their questions. We have a question.